Columbia Summer Public Health Scholars Program is an enrichment program funded by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Students from around the United States spend 10 weeks of the summer working with local, national, and international leaders in public health. They participate in a public health internship, take introductory public health classes, and visit communities around New York to learn about public health challenges and initiatives. Ultimately, the program fosters the personal and professional development necessary for students to become public health leaders. Public health is more important now than ever. If you don't have that infrastructure in place, if you don't have that adequate health system in place, you can see how one disease, one virus, can devastate a whole, whole nation. The Summer Public Health Scholars Program is really created to address the glaring lack of representation in the medical profession of folk of color, folk who come from a variety of diff different backgrounds that are completely disadvantaged. It's basically directed at all communities where health is an issue and where residents of that community are committed to do something about it. That's who we're really looking for. That's who I think the program is designed to serve. I think SPHSP is for everybody, but more importantly, it is for communities of color. We know that black and brown communities are affected disproportionately by public health issues more than, than other groups. And I think it is important that SPHSP is bringing in people from those communities getting them the knowledge that they need so that they can then go back and do the work that needs to be done. The program is really for undergraduate students who are interested in a career in medicine, dentistry, nursing, and public health. We're interested in those who come from disadvantaged communities and who want to make a difference in those communities because they're going to be directly attacking some of the health issues that so many communities of color in the United States confront. We're looking for folks who want to work there. So if you are super passionate about public health. If you're passionate about using health interventions to improve your community, then honestly, SPHSP is for you. Now that we have a better understanding of the program, let's hear about the benefits of having this experience in New York City. New York is the most populous city, so participating in this program will offer you a unique lens of population health that no other city would be able to provide. There is no place better than New York City to be studying at a place like Columbia and to be learning about and working on the issues in the public health sphere that affect the contemporary United States. There is no better place than that than New York City. Our program happens to be located at an institution that is in Washington Heights. Washington Heights is a Dominican community here in New York City where 70% of the population represents a group that is really struggling with many issues of health and access to health care. We also live on the border of Harlem. So one of the reasons why Columbia's role in this program is so important is that we are an institution that constitutes a laboratory for many of the challenges, for many of the problems, for many of the issues that people in medicine, dentistry, nursing, and public health are going to face throughout their professional careers. Being able to be in New York and study public health, you can't find anything better. While the program is tethered to New York City, the relationships fostered go far beyond the summer. The program's best resource for me was developing relationships and getting to know the people. Even years after the program ended, I could call upon my friends and ask about their experience or their opinion in an organization and vice versa, they can call upon me. So for example, I had a friend who called me just last year wondering about international experience and he called upon me because I ended up doing the Peace Corps right after some of public health scholars program and having to interact with him about what international work was like, what traveling alone was like, um, and what practicing public health in another country was like, really showed the value and important resources within the program. It's not only about what you know, but also who you know. Just last week I wrote a recommendation for one of my former students who was working with me at the Immigration Coalition to go to graduate school, so he decided that he wanted to pursue a career in public health, get a master's in public health, and I, I wrote a recommendation for him, which is probably the fourth one that I've done for students over the last several years, and I think it's based on cultivating a pretty short but really intense 
relationships through the type of work that we are doing. I'm still in contact with my mentor from the program. I remember reaching out to her a few months ago because I was going to the Abracams conference for SVHSP and I needed help making my poster better and she was she was more than happy to help me. And I have been in touch with her a few times after that and I plan to actually visit her soon because I'm currently working on my medical applications and I know she'd be more than happy to give me a recommendation. I'm also still in touch with my fellow scholars. We still use our group chat that we used when we were in the program a year ago. And whenever somebody has a problem, whenever somebody wants to talk, they go in there. And we're always there to support each other. And I think that's one of the most important takeaways I have from the program. We spend a great deal of time creating this mix of individuals uh, that ultimately produce lightning in a bottle each summer, each and every single summer. You're not just getting an education or you're not just seeing a new perspective of public health, but you're also gaining a community. And that's not just a community within your cohort, but that's a community among professors, a community among mentors, uh, and just everyone who was involved in the program, you can believe and trust that you would have a long-lasting relationship beyond the summer that you're involved in the program. I hope you consider coming to Columbia University Summer Public Health Scholars Program. Study public health in a city like New York where you have the energy, the people, the diversity, uh, the desire, and the top scholars uh, in the nation, in the field, all here at Columbia. Um, join us, let us help you learn, um, and help us make a difference uh, in the nation. This, this, this is public health. This is public health. This is public health. This is public health. SPHSP is made possible by funding provided by the CDC's Office of Minority Health and Health Equity.